Hello everyone, this is the Insert Title Show and I am your host, Wolf Strife. On this episode, I'm going to continue my go-through on Valiant Hearts. Let's see, I'm about halfway through Chapter 3. Rams Forest, Rams, yeah, Rams. Yeah, I remember this being a really, really cool one. Well, let's get to it, shall we? Ah, Barnes. Alright, uh, what's collectibles? Alright. <laughs> ah, Barnes. Choose it, the more cops. Uh, here. <laughs> The first one. There we go. Ah, wrong button. Well, might as well look at it. Ah, the MPs. I believe my grandfather was a military policeman in World War II. One of his many jobs, I guess. It's an interesting word, I damn it. <laughs> Boy, boy. No left. There it is. <coughs> Tent canvas. Ah, it was the next one. Christ, the next one's rather complicated. Uh, I'm not going anyway. Come on, Kyle. Yeah, this would be kind of scary in real life. Is this even what I want to do? <laughs> Just testing it out, man. Just testing it out. Probably I'm gonna run into swamp thing out here. I'm gonna get spied on it. I have a feeling. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, the nighttime looks very, uh, very cool. <coughs> Sweet apples. Mon dieu. <laughs> okay, where the hell is the next one? Alright. Okay. Then a locker inside this house. Jeez. Where the fuck up, Carl? Jesus. <laughs> I guess I'm getting old because this is really hurting my thumb. <laughs> Having to move the analog stick. 
round and round. There we go. Ah, that sounds like some interesting reading. Okay. Little treehouse operation here, boys. Didn't even know this uh, guy, holy shit. Guess I need to get up there and get some booze. Fair enough. Oh. Not really sure what their movements are though. Should be a rather thankless job being a prison guard. Eh, it's better than getting blown to pieces. Kitchener. I don't know why, but just seeing the word you, my brain automatically th <laughs> thought the guy was pointing at me and said, fuck you. <laughs> Guess I'm used to that. Let's see, what's the last one? Right at the end, there'll be a big tree. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I really like this part. I remember liking this part a lot. Just really, really cool. Oh, shit. Yeah, up in there. Hey, sheep. Would you the monkey? Some big ass sheep. Come on, ladies. Yeah. Oh shit. Hey, what is that? Ah, Shiza, Shiza. Good sheep, good sheep. Yeah, this guy looks pretty cool. Yeah, is this the part that I really like? Oh wow, yeah, that's cool. Players.
It's a lot of fogs. Not that look like suspenders. That's all the collectibles on this one. Uh, the moon's coming out. Oh, shit, uncoil. Shit with, with the games is glitch. I don't know. There we go. September 15th, 1916. Man. The bloody Battle of the Somme still raged on. 206,000 British soldiers would lose their lives there. Freddy was commissioned to drive the newest weapon of war, a major progress in a conflict that was literally stuck in the mud. But Baron von Dorf was also counting on this battle to shine in front of his superiors. Yeah, let's kick some ass. Ah, all right, battle the Somme. And by lost their lives, they probably mean killed, wounded, or captured, or missing. Yeah. Hate it when people confuse casualties with killed in action. Very, very confusing. Yep, Mark 1. I believe we used the Mark 5 and Battlefield 1. Yep. Alright. This is one of the coolest levels in the game. Let's have some fun. Alright, we got our male Mark 1 tank. Let's kick some ass. Basically, I have to keep all five of these guys alive for the human. Yeah, they're still alive. Somehow. Can't kill these pesky airplanes. See the light changes? That's really cool. Yeah. Uh oh.
Get in line, gentlemen. Okay, uh, let me see. What's first collectible? Promoting him. Okay, no. How do I promote somebody? I do need. Oh, wait. Anzac. Oh, there you go. So the last one. messed up with uh, when Walt and Emil got trapped on the barbed wire but that was uh, that was pretty good right there <laughs> yep. okay there's all the ones on here seems like the ones on the next one are gonna be a little tricky yeah we'll see this Hans. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> ah, good old buddy. He's kind of wanting me, he's kind of making me want to get a uh, French blue Kepi. Horizon blue. Wait. Oh, yeah, they fucked that tank up. Where did I get an emo? I think I still have to keep everyone alive, though, so watch out for that. Come on! Yeah, this animation looks great, man. Yeah, they are fucking around this time. After too many missteps and too many battles lost, Baron von Dorf was demoted and moved far from the front lines. For him, a fate worse than death.
January 18, 1917. Emil, still bedridden, beseeched Anna to travel to San Miel to find his daughter and share the sad news of Carl's death. Anna set off immediately. Jeez. Ah, I got a long way to go, man. Oh shit, bike cops. Ow, damn it. Oh, jeez. Carl has not had an easy war, has he? I don't know, none of these people have. Still not entirely sure why he changed ID tags, but whatever. Yeah. Wild dogs. I'm sure that happened. Hey, a phonograph. Huh, wax, huh? Okay. Using one of the collectibles or whatever. Exhausted, starving. Carl realized he'd never reach San Miel. His strength fading. Destiny still had one more surprise in store. They were only about 20 miles from San Miel 
when their hopes were again dashed. Oh, you would totally get shot if they carried you out. <laughs> yeah, you would totally get shot for this if they caught you out of uniform. Damn it, you son of a bitch. What? Okay, so I can't go up there or something. Hmm. Might be a little tricky. That ladder down. Hey, very horrible. Maybe wait for the guy to turn his back. Let's see. What? Doesn't give you a lot of time. Oh, okay. Oh, fucking Shiza. Maybe I have to knock him out, I guess. Oh, yeah, but what are you gonna do about that guy? I'm not even sure what that other outfit is. Is that just like peasant clothes or something? <laughs> Dear Fox. There's 10 Fox. Alright. Huh? <laughs> 
<laughs> oh yeah, and you gotta remember too, bran and wheat and all that stuff is a little rougher on the intestines and stuff. Let's see, last one. There we go. Yeah, the guy who made the uh, list of collectibles called this the gray outfit. It's not gray, it's rising blue. Thank you very much. It was designed so that you could blend in with the uh, horizon. Didn't really work, but you know, <laughs> it was worth a try. Yeah, fuck you, dude. They feel like the dog do it. Yep. Yeah, but have. Va por el crocón. of deduction wolf. Tension. Pulled that cane out of ah, another tax emission. Yeah. At least I don't have to worry about oh wait, I that. At least I don't have to worry about uh getting hit or not. How do I get all this dynamite? Oh Flashbacks to Grozny Grad. Shit. Oh, Shiza. Shit, 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 shit. 
Well, I'm gonna. Damn it. Sorry. Too many things to look at here. Oh, that's great. Batteries are dying. <laughs> Just let me get through this, I'll change on my sway. I always thought this was like the most metal classical music song ever. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, shit. Yeah, I really liked his uniform. Gotta suck into this. How the hell that missed me? Can I kill him, please? Shit. Hell. <laughs> uh, I'm sucking, but it's kind of fun. Sucking. That was a fun episode. Sorry for sucking there at the end, but yeah, no. Nah. Alright, nope, nope. We will see that on the next episode. Alright. One chapter left, guys. Just one left. <sighs> I'm excited. This is going well. I will see you guys next time.